Until until yesterday, I think there was there wasn't so much rivalry because the difference between me and him was uh, a little bit big still. But with the result yesterday, he moved forward and he said, "Well, Pedro, I'm here. I'm going to fight for the the spot in the national team. I want I want to be in the Olympic games." And I think that that's great. I think that's great. That's good. Well, at the end of the day, it's only it's business. It's never personal, isn't it? Yeah, of course, of course. When you're off that mat, then you can be friends. But exactly. There, it's, it's about being professional exactly. and getting what you want to, you put a lot of work in and what about the new changes that you see within this competition and all the tournaments throughout the world well do you like them well i, I i'm i'm a, a, a student in sports management you know and uh, I, i study a lot about marketing also and i think this is all about marketing you know yes, sports today they they have to be related with the tv because tv brings uh, the sponsorship And judo, it's still a very traditional uh, Japanese sport with a lot of rules, with very complicated, very long. To, to, to bring more people to, to the sport, to be more attractive in TV, for people to understand. Because people don't like to feel dumb. If I have to be honest, if I didn't practice judo, I was like watching judo and I, I couldn't understand what was going on. That's the difficulty, isn't it? Even though yeah. it's a very exciting sport to watch without knowing the rules, I mean, yeah. there is the complication of using it, isn't it? So. Yes. I think this is all about marking, but even though we, we can't forget about the judo... Um, uh, So we are not very Japanese styles. Yes, I, yes. For example, Telma. I think Telma will lose a lot with uh, with uh, with these new rules because be before she was, I think, number one, number two worldwide. Now she's not anymore because the no. the, the rules change and. But what it what it's doing is it's actually stimulating the athletes to be more creative exactly. and adaptable. And that's what we have to be as athletes, as former internationals. We need to be able to... Rules always change, and even from when my time... ...and not developing ourselves as people and as athletes. So I think that's a good thing. I also believe that the level of judo is very, very good. Yes. Becoming much more prepared and real athletes, and there is no such thing as an easy draw now. And with this straight knockout, you cannot possibly. Um, so everybody first match out. They're out. To yes, play. yes, and it makes that element of excitement very, very high. And the athletes themselves are so much better prepared. But I think the judo is improving. More upright posture is about better. Movement on the mat is improving. So, I think personally, I think the athletes have really adapted quite well in such a short period of time. They've changed. What do you think about two uh, in one weight catch from the same country at the World Championships? Oh, well, uh, again, this I, I, I'm before uh, I was in university. I have one opinion. Now I have another one. You know, for the public. Uh, it's essential to see the best athletes uh, on the um, on the mat. For example, before in the Olympic Games, it was so unfair because the European continent it's by far away the the strongest continent in the in the world, and you and you could see so many good judo players in Europe out of the the Olympic Games. And and uh, you see, for another hand, some South uh, American uh, judo players. Well, they are still good, but. Europeans are much better. But yes, the, much the, 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 yeah, much stronger. So I, I think it will be good for the show, and slowly judo will um, move on like other professional sports. Yes. I think slowly judo will uh, move on because it's important in the beginning for all the countries to have one representative, only one guy. It was important to, for judo to grow. Yes. But now it's, I think we, we have to move on to the next stage. Now it will be two, and I believe in a couple of years... That Possibly kill the sport for d different countries, certain countries. We rely heavily um, on... A lot of countries rely heavily on the support financially from governing bodies or um, sponsorships, and this is normally related in results. Exactly. If they are not able to represent their country 
in these particular events. I, I believe I believe that slowly judo will um, go in the same way as other sports like tennis or golf. Uh, Some years ago, a couple of years ago, it was impossible for you to believe that the judo guy would have a professional contract with the club. Nowadays, you can you, you see a lot of uh, people, for example, Telma here in Portugal, she has a sports contract like a football player. Yes. So things are changing and, and I believe uh, that tennis it works like this. doesn't matter if there's uh, 10 Americans in the uh, Roland Garros. They want to see the best ones. And this didn't kill the tennis in other countries. I think it, it will slow with different levels so people will adjust their levels to go to these tournaments. And uh, I'm not talking about one or two years. I'm talking about maybe 10, 15 years. I think this will start happening. And for the athletes, the preparation phases, the competition phase, rest periods seems to be less and less, isn't it? It's finding it very difficult because the pressure is on of a world rank. Yeah, but and because such as tennis and um, golf and these type of sports, judo is a contact sport. It's physically demanding on the body as well as the mind of everything else. So that physical contact of a sport is like your boxing. How many matches can your body sustain over a year without having the certain amount of rest period in between major tournaments? I, com the completely, I completely agree with you, but you, you have to say, before, uh, I remember when in for Athens, or n no, not Athens, but for Atlanta, you had 10 World Cups in one year. So all the athletes were going to these uh, 10 World Cups. Now you have so many World Cups, uh, more points, he will have to choose, okay, I want to do this competition. Difficult to get the happy medium, isn't it? Yeah, it's yeah, yeah, yeah. You feel that you have the results and you have the answers for one. You, you lack for the, the support and the, the answers for the, another situation. And going back to another